What is one reason you think Christian movies are so terrible? Most of the movies are made by the Western churches that have driven out um, any art. You're not allowed paintings. You're not allowed um, scenes of the life of Christ. You're not allowed anything that's an image. Even though in Exodus, God himself was saying how to decorate the temple with golden cherubim and sumptuous curtains and uh, pomegranates and palm trees. Not everything that's a sculpture is an idol. Moses was told in the desert to put the bronze serpent on the um, on the pole, um, which then later was treated as uh, in an idolatrous way, which is why Hezekiah destroyed it. But an image itself is not inherently idolatrous. A sculpture itself is not inherently an idol. This is what my whole series was about with the rosary, saying, we're not worshipping the beads. It's like an abacus that's used in China to help to do complex mathematics. The beads are used as a memory tool to help you if, like me, uh, and like the peasants of the 12th century, they didn't have um, uh, Sunday school growing up. They didn't know the stories. It's a nice way to learn the stories quite quickly. Um, but I think... If you look at the um, the Western churches, you, you walk into the church, it's very barren. There's nothing on the walls. There's nothing on the cross. Um, you get a sort of a bad knockoff of a rock concert. Um, but no beauty is allowed. Nothing that is beautiful. The words are beautiful enough. We're not allowed any beauty. And um, certainly not in art. So... With that, how can you imagine that the Western church is going to have an eye for beauty in their media and in their movies? It's gotten a bit better with a, with a couple of productions, but in general, um, Christian movies are painful to watch because they're so ugly. But because the words are right, because there's a couple of lines of Scripture, that should make it all all okay. Um, but there's this um, suspicion and this fear around anything that's beautiful that it's going to detract from God when actually it comes from God. 